What's up, Rollies? It's the man's fam. We are back with another video. And I look like the wall. We literally just woke up because you know we're going to keep it all the way 100 with y'all. Say so good morning, family. Good morning. Good morning. Anyway, we like Betty Boop in this family, but this is Betty Poop. Poop, poop, beat up. Poop, poop, beats. So it's like, change my diaper, change it. Hurry up, change it, I'm ready, change it. Today, y'all are gonna roll with me. Baby's got a meeting for her job. You know, she's almost done with that job because we almost ready to focus strictly on y'all. YouTube, 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 YouTube. So, she has a meeting. I gotta take the kids with me because I have clients in town again. So you gonna roll with us on a real day. A lot of y'all have asked, what do we do? So I'm gonna show you what I do. So I'm gonna get this baby cleaned up because she had a blowout. She pooped up her back. This is what happens when you tell your nine-year-old to separate his clothes. This is what he does. Yeah. Messiah. Let's go, baby boy. You gotta go to work with me. Tell me, tell me if y'all know how to do the splits. Size a little crazy when he wakes up. Ew, it's my dad woke up at 3 a.m. in the morning. It's like, Merry Christmas! <laughs> right. That's getting real. You see, C's doing all this stuff. So let's go, let's go, let's go. 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 Let's go, let's You're okay. You're okay, babies. We'll go bye-bye. She ain't really trying to hear that. As you can see. I hate doing my shoes like that, but you know, I don't got time to untie them. Because this little girl. Okay. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, puppies. I'm sorry. We finally made it to the car, y'all. Did you eat breakfast? Yeah. You did? Yeah. Good boy. I don't know what I would do without my big helper. It's a lot different going to work when we have CC, huh? Turn right onto East 4500. She just barely stopped tripping. She's trying to put a fish and the ball on her mouth. So I was like this. And the milk wouldn't go through, she started crying, and she wouldn't move her hand. So, <laughs> it's supposed to be tripping. So, anyway, y'all wanted to know what I do for work. Y'all going to work with me, so I'm lucky that I have the option of bringing my kids with me because I can't normally do this and I can nor not normally vlog with y'all because usually my clients are with me, but today, since my clients are not with me, I'm bringing my kids and I'm bringing y'all in the house. So y'all gonna actually roll with me today at work. So let's go. Gotta focus on the road. So, whoa. I'll see y'all when we get there. Lock the door. We in, y'all. Let me bring these babies in. fun begins so my baby's so smart it's funny because he's been rolling with me on these 
appointments so much that he has really good points. What did you just say about this one? Those stairs. And what would you have to consider? Spending more on the stairs, spending money to change the stairs. Because if you get because old, huh? Because how, and how long are they going to be there for? Did you like that house? Yeah. It's just there's like, you walk in and there's a living room. And you walk in more and there's a living room. This bomb is called an open concept, huh? Yeah. It's just like, I don't know. Because they would have to paint it too, so they'd have to spend more money on getting paint. Because oh. one of the girls scribbled on the wall. That's alright, that's minor. So this yeah, one was a yes. We are headed to the next one, so I'm sorry, I wish I could take y'all all through it and everything, but this is still work and people, you know, they deserve their privacy, so I'll show y'all what I can without invading people's privacy. So let's go. This. All right, so that house was so so from the outside, it looked pretty nice. Yeah, it just is, it seemed a little dated and too many walls. The open concept is where it's at nowadays. So we'll see what my clients think. I'm thinking they're gonna like the first one. First one was beautiful, it was really big, and I believe it was fully finished, but you know, I look in so many houses that sometimes I forget what was what. Gotta go to work, take your family to work then. So, so baby boy and I are just waiting on mama. Yeah. Mama is, oh, whoa, Cece in the back too. Gosh, I keep, I'm so clumsy lately. Cece in the back too. So we are um, waiting for baby. This is the second house that we came to see and then we are off to eat something delicious. So we've been meal prepping all week, eating healthy, paying attention to carbs, not necessarily low carbs because I've been needing my carbs because I'm nursing, but um, definitely not eating all the carbs that I want to eat and I think I'm eat some kind of cake today or something because I have been saying no to cake and donuts and all of those things and I am ready for like something like warm and chocolate or something but anyway stop fantasizing about things I shouldn't be eating and hopefully Cece keeps behaving herself and we just gonna wait for mama to get out um, from showing the houses so she's been showing some nice houses. She's got a client with a really nice budget. I mean, this don't show y'all no whole lot, but she's got a client with a good budget. This is one of the houses. She has a paper for this house already, but it's really a pretty house, decent neighborhood. Well, good neighborhood, but just an interesting view. I don't know how they're really gonna feel about the view, but anyhow, baby girl's done. She done being in the car with a cute self. She done being in the car. Mama, you done. I might have to pull her out of here for a minute. Oh, you wanna get out? You wanna get out? Are you hungry again? Sucking on your binky like that. Like you starving. Is that baby hungry? She need to eat? What's she doing? What's that baby doing? Oh, that little fussy. The baby was hot. <laughs> this is what she'd be doing all night. Sleep doing this. I want to know who whines in their sleep. Waking me up every five minutes with this. Hopefully she don't do that tonight because she done did that two nights in a row. Mm. About time. 
We starving. This ain't the one. No. Just wondering. Oh, yeah. I'm How was it? Poop. Really? Mm -hmm. I'm going to talk aside. Let me see that charger. Thank you. You know what we should buy? <laughs> <laughs> a cow. Turn left on 78. Alright, Roly. So, people always want to ask me. What do I do? And I always tell y'all. I'm going to tell y'all again. What do I do, Sai? You are a real estate agent. So what do I do? Sell houses. So I sell houses. But I can sell anything. What you need? Sell get it for me you. a Lamborghini. I get you a Lambo. What kind you want? What, what kind of job do you I'm want? Lamb I, I'm in the NFL. You're in the NFL? Mm -hmm. I need a check stuff. Maybe. Yeah, cause watch out, that was Anyway, y'all, I am a realtor and I enjoy my job. And right now, I'm looking for a home for my clients that are relocating here from California. So, so they moved to California, and then they somebody something about his job made him move back here. Yeah, so that's why they're relocating. See, this yeah. is my assistant right here. Yep. And he puts in minimum amounts of work, and then every time I close on a deal, he wants a big cut, a big chunk of my money. Right on Redwood. And so I'm trying to figure out the best way to fire him. I'm the real assistant. We just basically just got cut out of being your assistant, but I'm gonna remember that. Oh, I'm sorry, baby. Yeah, that's my sexitary. <laughs> Remember Granny called me that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Continue on. Nah, but Baby is my real assistant. She legit is my real assistant. She does help me with my paperwork. She looks everything up for me. She organizes everything. So without her, I'd always be late <laughs> and unorganized. This is a family business. Sai is a different assistant. Him and Money Miles, they are my marketing team. We always like put out um, posters and people's like Yep. Tell me your story about one time when we was on Walker Lane. Okay, we went to Walker Lane, right? There, I was walking Tell down the Walker Lane is. Walker Lane's like where these big houses are. So we were trying to sell this house. It was one of our uncle's house that we were trying to sell, right? And we did actually end up selling it. And so I went up to put it in to the slip. I rolled it up and went to put it in the door. But then I heard barking and I kept I was walking. <laughs> I and it's walking. a big house, y'all, yeah. so like I the driveways are long. a little bit slower, and I saw the garage was open, so I was like, mm, okay, I'm just going to walk slow. And then I see a big, ginormous white dog come out. I'm running, I'm running. I'm running about, uh, I'm probably running 21 miles per hour. <laughs> and then I jumped so high in the car, I hit my head on the thing. Man, so that was really a funny moment. And then Ashley so almost me and Miles, drove the car over because the dog was stupid, so he got in front of the car. Me and Miles were in the car, and I heard the dog too. And so I told Miles, open the door, open the door. I never seen Messiah run so fast. <laughs> he was running down this long driveway. And yeah, I never seen him run that fast in his whole, not even at track. Uh -uh. He had jetpack on him, but then he jumped in the car, and it was very funny because yep. we would always say, "What if a dog comes?" I'm like, "A dog ain't gonna come. Ain't no dogs." Yeah, there was a dog that day. So if y'all watch my vlog, going to work with your wife vlog, I money miles inside was somewhere, so they couldn't help me, and I had a, I was selling a house, and I needed to get some flyers out around the area or whatever so I had to do it myself what happened to your pay after that day but instead we get paid we got paid 50 last time and instead we get paid we got a lot of clothes but now your wage is a lot higher because that's torture work it was so hot and I remember having them out there in the big neighborhoods where the houses are all far apart and the driveways are all long for hours I mean a whole day I gotta go up to this castle looking place yeah. it was like it was like as big as a castle and I had like a big point as a castle kind of looked like a church but I 
I guess it was somebody's house. Yep, so I got a new squad. I have about 12 floors. This summer, we got another Miles that's on board. We just gave him right a job. Another Miles, yeah. so he's, he's about to play on my football. Well, other Miles, my cousin Miles. Hold it. We'll move to Cali, but we're going to see him really soon. This Miles is pretty tall. He's eight years old, and he's... I thought he was seven. No, he just turned eight. He just turned eight, and he's already like five foot four. The Something like eight. that. And the size of his shoe, you see, like, I'm size, I'm only about a size two, one and a half, right? He's a size eight in men's. <laughs> That's your lineman, huh? Yup. He's quick. He could, he could play all around. By all around, I mean he could play many positions. Because many people that are running back and stuff can't play all around because they're too small or they're too big to go to certain positions. But he's fast enough, strong enough to get to the level and stuff like that. So, yeah. Our year, our year we got my little cousin Lauren and Miles. We're about to smash him. Last year we almost we went to the playoffs. Um, we won one game and uh, we went to the playoffs, lost one game. Oh well, yeah, we were playing Iron Man football. If you don't know what that is, it means we don't have enough players, so everybody has to play the whole game. So we ha technically have nobody on the bench, and everybody has to play the whole entire game. Well, we're gonna go Eve real quick. Where we? We're gonna go eat at the Paisa Grill. So roll with us. Time to eat. Y'all see I'm slow. I'm like clumsy and slow lately. I don't know what to do with myself. I be tripping. Here we go. But she's smiling though. She's like, yeah. But I like to get back to my roots at times. Get with my people, you know, even though I can't talk to them enough. They be approaching me speaking straight Spanish, but I get sad when I can't talk to them. So we're learning as a family. But I gotta get to this menu, y'all, because I don't got no time to play. Let me see this. <laughs> you got your minion looking out the window? This is everything. I'm about to smash all of it. 